So let's try this one now. <clears throat> Calculate the volume of 4 moles of argon gas at 8.25 torr and 27 degrees Celsius. So did anything change in that problem? No. no. So what are we going to use? Just, Just the PV equals NRT. We're not doing PV equals NRT over PV equals NRT. Okay, so. So remember, R is going to be given to you. I'll give it to you right now. 0 0.0821 liters ATM per mole Kelvin. But we don't like to write it that way, remember, when we're writing it in a problem. I'll let you try to write it on your own this time, okay? So, um, do we know any of these things? P, V, N, or T? Yeah, we know, well, definitely N, right? What is N? 4.00 moles. And what else did you say we know? We know P, right, is what? 8.25 torr. You guys know the conversion? Yeah, it's the same thing. So torr and millimeters of mercury are essentially the same thing. It's just Dr. Tor was the guy who came up with the using millimeters of mercury, okay? So they decided to name it after. So, but he's dead, so you probably won't mind <laughs> forgetting that. So. He's just dead. Oh, I, I guess just dead. I don't know. He might be in a better place. Um, okay, so remember we want those in ATM. 8.25 divided by 760. So 0. Point, I'm just going to do 0. 0.0.9 for right now. Um, 18. I'll just keep that in my calculator. Um, do we know B? No, that's what we're looking for. And then we must know T, right? Or we wouldn't be able to do this problem. What is that? 27 plus 273, which equals 300. Okay, so they're going to want you to put a decimal place there. So make sure you don't do this to one sig fig. So I think you're going to want to do this to three sig figs, okay? So, what are we going to have to do now? What's the next step? Isolate the variable, isolate the V, okay? So how do we do that? Divide both sides. Good job, by V. So V equals NRT over P. This is the exact same like we did earlier, okay? So, Let's write it over here again. N R T over P. So just plug and chug now. We know N 4.00 moles. We know R. How are we going to write it? Very good, guys. On two lines, not one. Why would you do that? Because it's easier to see the canceling, you know? And then T. What's T? And then all divided by 0 0.01098. Okay? So cancel. We got numerator, denominator, moles. Kelvin, numerator, denominator. ATM, numerator, denominator, left with liters. Is liters a good volume uh, yes. unit? Yes. Yeah, so we've done it right, you know? So if you get your units right, you know you've done it right, okay? I mean, then you got to plug everything into the calculator, but... Okay, 
So four and zero point eight two one or point zero eight two one times three hundred all divided by point zero um one oops zero Zero point zero one oh I'm gonna say eight five five. Because that's what it is, right? So what do you guys get? Nine point zero four times Nine point zero I yeah, we just did different numbers there, but I got nine point zero seven. Nine any of those numbers would be fine. It's just we rounded this number differently. Uh, times 10 to the 1, 2, 3, right? Please. Okay. Is that what you guys got? Or 9,076, right? Okay. So, what is the same? Four moles at this much pressure and this much temperature is going to be that much volume. Okay? Is everybody cool with that? Any questions on that one? Questions? Questions? Okay, cool. Huh?